What's up my Blickabites? Welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome back to a brand new Cast Monday. Guys, I'm excited because I finally this is like I finally got some inspiration and I was like I posted on Twitter um basically how I was irritated because I could not get any inspiration or any like you know um create a sim spark or anything that i could like you know make a video on that i would really enjoy and talk about and i didn't want to post anything how i always say that's half crap or i really don't appreciate or really do love so i didn't really want to you know i didn't want to make a voiceover and it was corny and then like i lose the love for it you know i don't know i don't know <laughs> But anyway, how are you guys today? It's today for me. It's Monday, and it should be Monday for you because I'm posting it on a Monday. But yeah, how are you guys today? And if you're new here, I did not even say this in the beginning. But if you're new here, um, hi, my name's Blixar. If you want to see more of my videos, just hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you can be notified every time I post a new video. I'm like. All right, but yeah, guys. Um, just jumping right in. This is a sim that I've made. Nope, I don't know her name. I just made her a couple of minutes ago. Nope, I don't know her name. I I really I'm I'm terrible at it, guys. I'm so sorry. I really am. I really am terrible at making. I mean, remembering my Sims names like. But anyway, I love her so much, guys. I, I literally, I she's such a simple sim. She's not like a sim that you'll be like, oh my god, like she's so character defined. Like she is. Like don't get me wrong, she is. But like she's just like the type of sim that's just like. She's like, uh, you would love to play her because she's just so humbling, you know? I don't know. I just, I love how I made her, and I'm excited for you guys to see. She has a cat, and her cat is kind of, he's like an orange cat, and he's like, he's, she, she loves her cat so much. Like, she, I kind of picture her living in, like, a colder area or a colder climate, and she's kind of like, she has a cat, and I don't know. She doesn't really have a really big backstory. I didn't really come up with anything crazy. I just thought of it as just like, she's just a sim, and it's up to you guys, whatever you want her story to be. And if you want me to, if you want to see her in my, in any gameplay for me, then let me know, because I tried to do a test run yesterday on, sorry, I tried to do a test run on how it would look or like you know how like, you know my game runs when i'm trying to film a let's play or anything like that's like 20 minutes or just longer or just me being live playing the game and you guys actually hearing me play while i'm um while i'm you know going through just basically going through the world and just playing the game but anyway yeah um i tried it and i filmed a whole video right guys oh my god i was so heated i filmed a whole video and guess what guess what my volume or my audio was mute and all you just saw is just me basically just playing my game but the whole time i thought that i was like talking you can hear it but it wasn't i was so mad i was so mad because that was going to be a video i was going to post this week and <laughs> i'm like i'm not crying but like i'm just irritated it, it brought tears to my eyes like i was i was so upset but anyway how but yeah um on some other news, I'm sorry, I'm just looking at her while, while we're just, you know, chatting and talking. I want to some other news. I'm really, I really, really, really want to know what the next game pack is going to be because we did, we just got announced that we're having the knitting pack. We have announced that we had, um, we had, um, eco living and I just feel like we have one more pack for the year, like they said, and I'm just really excited. I really want to know what is it going to be because I feel like. I, I really, really, really hope it's like a Generations pack or something like that because I love family. Sorry, guys. I had to burp. I love family gameplay, and I just love, like, I don't know. I just feel like it's so humbling to have, like, um, you know, have babies or have newborns and have onesies. And I feel like if we got a game pack that was like that or it was kind of like, like, you know, towards that type of gameplay... I feel like it will be like perfect because we have the um we have the the knitting pack com is coming out and it's going to be perfect because you can kind of like have your older your older sims in the rocking chair holding the newborns or we can have basically family nights or game nights like oh you can have like card games and trivia i don't know i feel like that would be so fun like you can have all your sims gathered out on the couch or something like that and it's like everyone like you kind of have like a thing where you can like buy like on build and buy like you can get like a, a stack of cards or like a trivia game little thing and you can kind of like you know basically like have your family just play it at night or you can set like a little schedule on like the schedule board of basically like oh family night tonight or oh um llama llama 
Mama Tuesday or I don't know anything like that. I'm just I really hope you get something like that. I I love generations like I we had generations in the sims 3 and i was in love with it like we just need to have in the sims 4 like please i understand we had parenthood but that i feel like that wasn't really touching and going deep in into just basically having a generations pack and i hope we do get something like that i don't know but anyway yeah honestly guys my week has been really chill like honestly i got a video out i, I really was just in love with like this sim i finally got a video out and i don't know i'm i got my room done i got my room done over i sorry i just looked away that's why i kind of like didn't you know oh and by the way i also wanted her to use this big hair but then i just was like nah i don't know i just don't i see it on her but then i really didn't and I just, I fell in love with this hair and I always wanted to use it, but I never could find a sim that really could rock it. So I found her and I don't know, I don't know. I might have her wear that big hair one day or something like, you know, she just had her little silk press or something like that. And she just decided, you know, maybe one day she decided, let me just grow my hair out. Let it get all natural. You feel me? I don't know. But yeah, anyway, yeah, I decided I wanted to basically um, redo my room. I've been talking about it lately. I wanted to redo my room, so I got um, I got my wood floors put down. I painted my walls white. I got my LED lights up. I got my bed back in my room finally because I was like sleeping on like my mattress, but not like my actual bed frame, which was kind of annoying because I really did miss my bed. But um, yeah, I am. I got some. I'm getting basically like channel art done for me from the Sim Scrapper. Shout out to him. Like he, we, he, he's really talented, guys. Like I really do, really, really love his artwork. So he's doing stuff for me, and I'm really excited for that. And I don't know. Sooner or later, when I start to like really get confident in my videos and stuff like that, I might start doing face cam, a face reveal. But I mean, I kind of show my face sometimes on my Twitter. But if you haven't seen my face and you're kind of like you know you kind of subscribe to, to me from just YouTube and not like my Twitter. Yeah, I might show my I'm gonna show my face sooner or later. I just wanted to like you know really get like the details or basically like the the things that like the key points of my channel. I wanted to kind of like make sure everything was kind of like perfect. I mean I mean everything's not gonna be perfect, but I just wanted to be close to perfect, and I just really want my content to be really good for you guys before I start doing extra things. And I don't know. I'm excited. I'm excited for what's to come to this channel, and I'm excited for all my new Blickabites. If you guys are new or if you guys heard of me and you just just just, just decided see look tongue twister and just decided to basically just stop by and look at this channel or just watch one video and you know you vibe with just watching my creative sims or my builds if I post them occasionally. Um if you just vibe to anything on my channel, I really do appreciate it. Or if you just vibe to my voice, if you <laughs> I don't know. I don't discriminate or I don't judge. I just look if you if you like anything on this video or anything on this channel that wants that makes you or tingles your creative side or <laughs> creative bone. Literally, I don't care. I just I want you guys to really enjoy my channel and vibe out to it and really enjoy it for what it is. And I don't know. I don't know. I'm I'm just I love you guys so much for just all your support and all your your love and your comments and your support and all your help and I really do appreciate it. It, it really is heartwarming to see that I have like a little family that actually, you know, really supports my channel and really is like, you know, a true blick a bite <laughs> you know what i mean like i don't know i'm i'm really I, I really love this like i love i love this youtube and i love this channel and i just i don't know i'm getting all warm and fuzzy <laughs> but anyway yeah she's starting to come together and whenever i see her name then i can tell you because i like, literally like you know how i get like i don't remember a name for nothing but yeah i don't know I, I started to really enjoy finding like small accessories and stuff like that that i can put under shirts like that orange turtleneck under her under her vintage top really really brought together her outfit and i don't know it just made it's like kind of like a staple point for her like it just made me think like oh that's her that that's her staple she loves wearing um turtlenecks under tops or under vintage tees or something like i can picture her going into like like vintage shops or something and like basically like just getting like a whole bunch of stuff oh i'm sorry guys I'm sorry, guys. I'm a little tired. I've been up all late last night, guys. Like, I'm sorry if I you just heard that yawn. But look, no editing here. I said that in the beginning of my YouTube. Like, look, if it's, if it's not that serious, I'm not about to edit it out. You feel me? 
but anyway yeah i wanted to add some more accessories to her but i was like look that hat just looks like a little too much i'm gonna just i'm gonna just leave her how she is and just leave her how she is and leave her with her little turtleneck and just leave that as her staple point you know and i also i was thinking of making having her wear like a full body i you know i was planning on sorry guys I was planning on doing all her outfits, like all her stages, like her formal and her exercise and stuff. But then it turns out I did not add all my CC that I just downloaded today in my folder. So like it was just like I couldn't. So I was just like, ugh, I'm just I was irritated. But then I was like, look, just keep on, keep on pushing on, and just add her cat. And that's going to be the video. But anyway, guys, we're coming close to the end of the video. And I want to thank you guys so, so much for watching this video or watching any of my videos or just subscribing. And I just, um, with that being said, I want to thank you guys so much. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. And it isn't Pixar, but it is Blixar. And I'll see you guys in my next video. All right, guys.